artificial intelligence has changed the music industry. Musicians are not shying away from embracing AI as a creative ally. They are using it to write songs and compose music tracks. As a result, the use of AI has become a topic of debate in the music industry. Some think AI has the potential to kill music, while others are of the opinion that it could lead to a new era of creativity. We get you more information in this report. Using artificial intelligence to make music is a topic that has divided opinions in the industry. It's never going to replace live music. It's absolutely not going to go away. I don't like it. We don't like it. Thanks to recent groundbreaking technological advances, generative AI can already produce original sounds, lyrics or entire songs on its own. Robots are now making music as digital pop stars, while existing artists often use simpler AI to enhance their sound. As technology continues to develop, the question remains, will AI mean the death of original music or herald a new era of creativity? This is a studio in London's Queen Mary University. This is one such place where music meets cutting-edge technology. PhD student Max Kraft showcases Nets, a virtual instrument played by wearing an augmented reality headset which tracks hand movements to create corresponding outputs like notes or chords. Andre Martinelli, on the other hand, fiddles with guitar, an advanced guitar with AI sensors which reads movements to make drum and synthesizer sounds. The way it works is that it's got a little bit of uh, like a simple artificial intelligence that tracks whether you're coming down with a heel or you're coming down with the fingers, and it's consistent all across the body. So, so if you have different techniques, if you have different percussive techniques, you can you can all use them. While artists have used technology for creative purposes since the 1950s, the use of AI like Nets and the Hita could be the newest tools to experiment with music. Young Blood, a UK alternative rock artist, believes AI could be a tool for his music. It allows me to get another space of inspiration or like another way of thinking. I think when I, it's never going to replace live music. I think, and um, that's mainly the way I lead from. So like, I'll use it in a scenario where I'll be able to take a beat off a off a track, or I'll be able to pull a guitar line off a track to take me to another direction. Meanwhile, the alternative rock duo, the Nova Twins, disagree. We don't like it. I feel like you need AI to help you write a song, or especially when it's for likeness. That's not cool. Last year, thanks to the power of artificial intelligence, fans got to enjoy one more Beatles song featuring the voice of John Lennon, extrapolated with AI from an old recording. While labels and streaming companies partner to market the technology, many experts say AI raises legal or ethical concerns, especially when generative AI regulation is still in the early stages. The sort of problem that we've faced is that there have been a real proliferation of AI developers who have trained AI models with large-scale amounts of copyright works without actually getting any authorization for doing so, and then using those tools to generate new content that actually competes with the very works that they've misappropriated. So what does the future look like for AI in the music industry? Its place in the music production chain Again, if it's guided in, in, in the right way and uh, if we ensure that the, the, the musicians keep, keep a certain amount of, of control and performers as well. Cutting edge tools are revolutionizing the music industry. With AI powered software and tools, musicians and producers can now compose and mix music like never before. <laughs>